Hey guys, it's Nancy Ann. There's Ruger. <laughs> he and I are in my home gym and we're going to record February stitch fix for you. I know I had said that I wasn't sure when I was going to be able to record again because of circumstances going on in my life, but this came in today and I brought it downstairs and said to Sam, should we record it or not? And he said, I think we should. So we have this for you instead of me keeping it all for myself. I hope that you enjoy it and let's get into this. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I had mentioned a couple of videos ago that I did not know when I would be able to record again because of a bunch of stuff that's happening with my mom back in California mostly, but there's some family things going on too. Uh, we've had a bit of a pause. I haven't had to go out to California yet, but I have been busy with my brother and sister discussing her care and where she's going to go. If she's in a rehabilitative care right now and she's having some memory problems. So if, if uh, any of you could pray for my mom, I would really appreciate that. We're, we're quite concerned about her, but I did get a stitch fix today. Sam is currently teaching online. He is an online professor and he's grading a lot of papers, so we don't know exactly when this will get out. He'll get it up and as much editing as he does, as quick as he can, and then I'll finish it up when he can get off of his computer. But I thought it would be fun to do a really quick recording of Stitch Fix. If you don't know how Stitch Fix works, I do have all of that in my cliff notes that are uh, in the description box. I will also pin those to the top of the comments as soon as I see this when it comes up on the channel, when it goes live. The one thing you do wanna know is if you use my link, you will get a $20 credit towards Stitch Fix and I will get a credit as well. So let's take a look. Stitch Fix always sends you five items. There is the prepaid mailer to send everything back. Shipping both ways is free. The Oh Hello card with my stylist note, as well as outfit ideas. They sent me the preview. I picked a couple of items. I can't remember what, to tell you the truth. I don't even remember what I told her to, to get for me. I have no idea. Should have asked for spring, didn't think about that. And then here is the invoice. I usually save that until the end with the prices. Now let's get into, ooh, I got shoes. I'm so glad about that because I like stitch fix shoes. They're size 11 and that's hard for me to find. And here is, that's the better size. There is our bundle. So this is gonna be interesting. A little pair of shoes. Should we get into the shoes first? Let's do that. Oh, it's heels. Oh, I think I remember now. I had told her I could use a pair of pumps. Set that down on the ground. Oh, there's Ruger. Can you say hi to everybody? Say hello. He's just meandering around. I put his bed back there to try and entice him. And I don't know. If, oh, good. Oh, yay. It's just a pair of plain black pumps. I just wanted some that had a little more of a current silhouette. I hope these work. I could really, really use those. Might be a little high, but we'll see. I'm not as comfortable in high heels as I used to be. When I was younger, I wore high heels all the time. The only time I wasn't in heels was when I was at the gym. All right, let's get into our bundle. Ruger is down there thoroughly investigating the shoes and the box. Okay, first item. Mm. I had asked for pajamas. And I think she sent me some pajamas. I said, I didn't really need a lot. It's, it's coming to me as I'm, um, geez, these are stuck. It's coming to me as I'm unboxing. Okay, well, we're just, <laughs> the tags are stuck together. But it looks like we have a pair of bottoms with pockets. Oh, good, pajamas with pockets. I don't think I have any pajamas with pockets. And then a little top. Is it long sleeved? It's short sleeved, but that's okay. Okay, my first impression of this looks a little like scrubs. What do you think? But I'll try them on. We'll see. I could use another nice set of matched pajamas. It always seems like I have just pieces, you know, like they kind of work together, but they're just pieces. Okay, what is this? I have no idea what this is. Oh, it's a skirt. I may have picked this for my preview too. I don't remember. So it's a black and white print with some leaves. Cute. It's pleated though. Bleeding sometimes isn't so attractive on me with the hips, but we'll see. And, ooh, we have a soft, cozy top. This is an ivory, an ivory wide ribbed top. I actually like this. I have been looking for really soft tops lately. It's what I've been wanting to wear. This winter has been cold and wet and rainy. We only had one really good snow though. And then a pair, ooh, I like these. These are by Democracy. They've got that Absolution, I think that's called technology. It's just, their waist usually fits real good because of that. And it's um, 
a little bit of a wide leg, it looks like. Okay, so there is my five pieces. I'll be right back with the try-on. These two pieces were hooked together because they were supposed to be. They wanted to let me know that this is a set and both pieces should be returned or else I get charged for the whole thing. So I was concerned about the color. I thought it may look a little like scrubs. It may still, but I can tell you this, these are super duper comfortable. There is a size large and often a size large top is just too big for me. But look with the ruching at the sides, I can kind of make it work a little better. I think that's a really neat detail. This is by Bobo, by the way. So yeah, I kind of like that. And they're nice and long. They have a little split at the hem. And guys, I'm aware that I have a little VPL going on here. Um, people like to point that out. <laughs> but this is my pajamas. I'm really not going to be wearing this in front of anybody. I just need to be comfortable and feel good about how I look in it. And I don't look at the backside of me in the mirror. So this has the potential to be a real keeper. I think this is really cute. The color is not my best. But again, this, these are pajamas. I just need for them to be comfortable and serviceable. Did he lay down? He laid down. We got Ruger back. Okay, I will be back with another outfit. Lauren is my stylist this time again. I don't know if I had her last time or the time before, but she's done a really great job in the styling of this fix because I love these three pieces together. Apparently, I chose both the top and the skirt in my preview, and she said that they would work well together, and they really do. And then, of course, she included the Vince Camuto heels. So let's start out with the top. The top is that ribbed brush knit that I showed on the unboxing portion. It's a winter white kind of, sorry, but there's blowout from my ring light there. Very cute, soft top and look, it's lined on the inside. I absolutely love that. So I don't have to worry about show through. The only beef I have is on this side, it covers my bra, but on this side, it just shows it a teeny tiny bit. That doesn't bother me too bad. I don't know if it's the bra or if it's that I'm like most women and one breast is bigger than the other one. That was more information anybody wanted to hear. And now let's move on to the pleated little skirt here. Normally, like I said on the unboxing part, pleats don't do that well on me. Something about them kind of widens my hips, probably because they're being spread out, but I think the pattern saves this. I can see this being a real classic skirt that I could wear all the time. Uh, with many different things and different jackets and things like that. I have a white blazer that would be cute with this. I have several moto jackets, of course, a black blazer. I even have a hot pink blazer that I think would be really cute with this. It has a set in waistband and then it's elasticized in the back and I was able to just pull it up over my hips. I do think the waist is supposed to come up a little higher. Um, I think it's just a little bit low on me. It's a little bit loose, but I think that this should work fine. Now let's talk about these gorgeous heels. These are really cute and I really wanted them to work, but my right foot doth protest too much. It's, it's just too tight across the toe. I have that problem a lot. I think this foot's just thicker <laughs> than the other one. And I believe my right is my foot that's also larger. So I don't think those are gonna be able to stay, but I do like both of these pieces. Okay, I'll be back in just a second with the jeans. Can you do me a real quick favor and hit that like button? That really helps the video. And also make sure that you're subscribed. Over half of the people who watch me are not subscribed and I'm getting closer to 2000 subscribers and that would be really cool if I could reach that sometime soon. That would kind of make my day. Okay, or my, really my month. <laughs> Alrighty, let's talk about the democracy jeans. I just went ahead and slipped the pumps right back on because they're frankly the only shoes I have down here unless you count my slippers, which I think are shoes, but most people do not. I love the fit of these. Now they feel a little tiny bit snug, but I think as time goes on, they are going to grow. They have some stretch in them and they strike, they feel like the type that will kind of stretch out. I don't know if you can see the pocket and I'll try to remember to show you when we do prices, but the pocket is kind of unique. So I like that too. So I have a, quite a few jeans, at least I feel like I do but these would be something a little bit different in my jean wardrobe and give me one more option. Jeans are really the bottoms that I wear the most often. Nice high waist. I love the absolution. I think that's what they call it with democracy that brings it in in the back to my, the small of my back so it doesn't gape. That's a big problem I have. These would also work equally well with a pair of flats. They're really kind of the perfect length. Alrighty, let's pull it in close and do a quick wrap up.
I'm really happy to be out of those shoes. They were super squishy on my right foot. Alrighty, we ready to get into some prices? Let's see what we have here. This is almost a five for five. If it weren't for the uncomfortableness of the shoes, it may be. With Stitch Fix, you save 25%, of course, if you keep all five pieces. So sometimes it's the same price or even less if you keep all five pieces than if you keep four at regular price. So let's see what we have here. The Vince Camuto footwear. Katie, or C-A-D-I-E, Katie suede heel. That is not suede, folks. If that's suede, it's a suede without much nubbiness at all. In black, size 11. These are $99. Good quality. Just hurt my feet. Now are all the pieces I really liked. The Nine Britain Gwendolyn Square Knit, Neck Knit Top. This is in white, size medium, $40. Great price on that one. I, th I think I might be keeping this. And by the way, probably by the time Sam gets a chance to edit this and I do my part, I'll have already sent this back. I probably will have already made up my mind, but I'm still really interested in hearing what you guys think about these pieces, what your thoughts are on them. And then again, it could be he gets them out real quick and I still have them. I don't know. And now the Bobo short sleeve top with sl slit pants sleep and lounge set. There we go. That's what that is. This one is 55, hey, $55. That's not as much as I thought it would be. I think, I think, Oh boy, this could be staying with me too. Hmm. Okay. Now we got the skies are blue Harlow pleated crepe skirt in black, size 11. This is 58. Wow, she kept the prices great in this one. $58. That's not bad. I like that too. Oh boy. You know, last time all I kept was a white sweater and that was affordable. This one's threatening to, <laughs> to be a little more expensive here. And then we have the Catherine Echo Bootcut Jean, and I was gonna show you that pocket on the back. Look at the detail, the little split down the middle with a little pointy at the end. I think that's kind of cute. An indigo, size 12, these are $88. The entire fix is $344. Then the buy all discount is $85, which would make the order subtotal $255. Now, the styling fee is $20, and then that would go back against it, and then you would only pay $235. That's not bad for all five of these pieces, including a pair of um, Vince Camuto shoes. I can't think today. It's late, guys. That's really good. The $85 is less than the price of the shoes, so it would actually be better off for me if I was gonna keep all of them, would come to about $240. I, I'm not going to spend that much right now. Um, we, we have a potential plane flight to California for me <laughs> coming up uh, to help with my mom. We don't know when that might be and some other expenses. So I'm trying to keep things down, but I'm really going to have to think about what I want to keep. Let me know what you would keep. I'm really kind of leaning into the pajamas because I have the biggest need for these. And I do like this top. I have lots of tops. I need a skirt. That one might stay. And I love these jeans, but if I was gonna pick two, it probably would be these two just because they would get the most juice, I don't know. I'll think about it, I'll make a decision. If we get this out in time, you can help me with my decision. Let me know what you think. Stick around to the end. I think my husband's gonna have plenty of bloopers to choose from on this one. It's been a comedy show in here with me and Ruger. Um, well, <laughs> in between takes. But we will see you on the next video. Bye-bye and be blessed. Just popping in here real quick, because I should have said this before, bye bye and be blessed. I want to thank you very much for watching my videos and sticking with me, even though I'm not as regular as a lot of YouTubers are. You guys are the best. I just have the best uh, viewers, and I know I've said that before. I, I appreciate each and every one of you, and again, to anyone who has ever used my links and given me some credit with these styling service companies, thank you very much to you as well. I love you guys. You're absolutely terrific. All right, now, bye-bye and be blessed. Well, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Ruger is right here. You might see his little tail. I don't know. No, that was dumb too. Let's try again. Welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are returning. 
I'm going to start that again. I, it's been too long since I've done this. <sighs> Ruger, go sit back there. Be the star of the show. Look, your bed's back here. Look, come here. Come here, look. You want to lay in the bed? Oh, boy. Here, everybody wants to see. You know, there's no food there. It's just the bed. That's a box. Mm -hmm. Okay, and, and you want to lay in the bed? Come on, lay down. All right, no dice. Well, the pajamas were hooked together because they were supposed to be hooked together. I'm shouting. Why am I shouting? Let me try this again. The pajamas were hooked together because they were supposed to be. They were reminding me that this was a set, and if I didn't return both pieces, they're going to charge me for the whole thing. Here he comes. He is having a hard time settling down today. I can make this kind of custom fit me, which is making this set work. You okay, buddy? He's throwing his blanket around. He's having a little bit of a temper tantrum. I'll, fit, I'll fix it between outfits.